Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, I got on YouTube uh, last night. I hadn't made any videos in a couple days. And, uh, man, I was noticing all the drama. You know, I know I had my drama. Uh, you know, I let some people get to me and piss me off. And I said I wasn't going to make any more videos. And everybody knows. And then I made the video saying that I take that back. And, look, I'm totally not upset because I have this new way of thinking, you know, I don't, I don't care nothing about the drama. Like Bubba Effect said, you know, we need to remember, we knew when we got on here doing this that we were going to stir the hornet's nest. We knew that. So we just have to just roll with it. These people aren't going to bother me, but uh, I want to reiterate that I really meant what I said, you guys. Just use your judgment, follow your gut feeling, quit feeling obligated to let these people take up your time arguing with you. I mean, I, nothing pisses me off than arguing with somebody that, you know, they, that doesn't obviously doesn't know their ass from a hole in the ground. So why do you, you know, so forget them, man. So as soon as I, I haven't had any lately, but as soon as I notice that somebody's uh, just trying to take up my time and irritate me, I just block them. Block them. Man, wouldn't it be great if eventually we could just have them all blocked? That'd be cool. Anyway, what uh, another thing I want to talk about is uh, not that it bothers me. I just want to update you guys. Uh, somebody tipped me off and sent me a message that Free Speech opened an account on uh, Live Link, which or Live Live Leak. It's some video place. I think it's Live Leak. So I clicked on the link and I went and looked. Well, he has taken my video where I called him out and he has posted it on live leak and then on the title of the video he puts on there like a uh, free speech blocking me laughing out loud I guess he thought that people were gonna side with him or something I don't know because what's so funny is he posted it on his account at live leak which by the way his his account name there is free speech first that's F R E E S P E E C H the number one ST. So that's his account on Live Leak. And uh, so he posts my video that I made about blocking people where I name him on there. And so what's so funny is there's a sh there's just a shitload of comments on there. And they're all on my side. Like all the comments are like, yeah, we got to block all these dividing people. So I'm really confused. I don't know if he's just trying to irritate me by showing me that he can move my video around. Also, if any of you guys know anything, I don't know much about the copyright deals. and I don't know if he really has a right to do that or if there's anything I can uh, do or say about him uh, taking my video and then posting it under his account. I mean, if it was a matter of permission, certainly I wouldn't give somebody like him permission to use my video. But anyway, Free Speech has a live leak account called Free Speech First. The number one ST, and he's got my video up there. And I don't know why he did that, because I thought it made him look bad. But I guess he thought it made him look good. I don't know. And he's continuing to uh, flame at me on My Sacred Honor's page, uh, replying to uh, my comments on My Sacred Honor. All right, enough of that crap. Let me get rid of the cigarette. I hope everybody's doing great. All my all my real bros out there and all my real sisters out there. Oh, God, the ants are getting me. Dang. All right. I want to show something really cool. Uh, uh, Sammy. You guys know Sammy from the VGM, my good uh, Patriot buddy. The guy, you know, working in the garden with and all that. Man, he really touched me. He gave me this wonderful gift. I want to show this. You guys that were in the service, Apache Grunt, Bubba Effect, uh, uh, nasty nine uh, all you guys that were in the service you, I know you guys can really appreciate this I know I appreciate it more than anything in the world but check this out I hope you can see it I'm gonna try to put it in the light can you see this thing it's like a paper carrier or like a photo box it says US occupation zone and then it has like Germany on it and all the names of the German towns. Check that out. And this thing is made out of brass. And it says right on here, 1948. Right? Check out this treasure, dude. To me, well, here is the kicker. Here's what makes this so special. 
This was Sammy's grandfather's. And he presented this to me the other day. And I was like, no, dude, I can't take this, man. I can't take this thing. And and I'm telling you, if I didn't accept it, he was going to pinch my head off. That's how adamant he was that he wanted me to accept this as a gift. And I just could not be more honored, man. You know, because I wasn't in the service. And... You know, what a what a gift, man. Check this out. And his grandfather carried this in Germany for like seven years. Now, I guess right here was a... I don't know, maybe some of you guys know, this is missing. Maybe this, I don't know, this might have said Rangers or uh, who knows, or whatever division or whatever you call it that he was in. But I just hope that you guys, somebody out there will recognize this. And this is just awesome. And what a gift, man. So I just will treasure this for the rest of my days. I will keep this. That I just it's neat just to hold this, dude. The the history that this thing probably has. Here, let me let me open it up. Hang on. I mean, dude, when you open this, you can smell the history in this thing. I mean, it actually still has like dirt in it from Germany. This thing is incredible, man. Uh just a great piece of American history and the fact that it, it was his grandfather's and he insisted I take it uh, just amazing man what a gift and I'm really grateful for it so Sammy when you watch this video hey thanks buddy I know I've already thanked you and hugged your neck but thanks a lot man it really means a lot to me what a cool thing huh anyway look at the patina on it the natural wear I mean, to me, it's beautiful like it is. I thought about polishing it up with some brass polish, but I don't know, man. I might just leave it like this. Check that out. Anyway, so I really just wanted to show you guys that. And uh, plus give you that little update on uh, how that dude free speech, man. He just won't let it go. But I'm not, I don't care. I'm not even worried about it. It doesn't even bother me. I just think it's funny. And, and, uh. You know, while I'm irritated, he's taking my videos and posting them on Live League. Then again, uh, he's just helping me spread my message. So, you know, uh, I'm going to check in to see if there's anything I can do to stop him from reposting my videos. But if I can't and there's nothing I can do about that, well, all he's doing is helping spread my message. So, plus when you click on there, it tells you that, uh, that the video is outsourced from YouTube. So, that'll just cause people to... He'll just get me more subscribers. So thank you, Free Speech, uh, for adding subscribers to my channel. I'm sure that that's what will end up coming from it, because I doubt there's anything I can do about you, uh, about you posting my stuff. <coughs> Bubba Effect. Uh, Bubba Claus. Hey, man, thanks a lot, man. Uh, I feel proud when I know that men of honor, especially men that were in the service and have seen the real shit, when they commend me, or give me, you know, any type of props whatsoever. Like, I'm real proud of that. That that makes me feel like I'm doing a good job. Uh, but, you know, it's really not a job. I'm just being myself. I'm just, you know, saying, you know, what I think. And uh, so, Bubba Claus, man. Bubba Effect, thanks a lot, bro. Enjoyed that video a lot. I put that on my favorites list. Your videos are hilarious, by the way. Uh, even when you're serious and you're pissed off, I mean, you're, you're a funny guy, and uh, I enjoy watching your videos. Uh, Apache Grunt, Redneck, Sheepdog, Simple Dan, uh, Stonewall, I can go on and on and on. Jay Carilla, all you people, keep it up, and uh, don't let the little, the little piss ants get to you. They're nothing. Don't let them bother you. Anyway, this is awesome. Thanks a lot, Sammy. And uh, hope all you guys have a good evening, good supper, whatever. I guess that's about it, yo. All right, Dan.